The benefits of pet therapy are well known, and a Victoria nonprofit is all about spreading the love. Volunteers with the Pacific Animal Therapy Society have been making a difference in our community for more than three decades. And after a COVID shutdown, they're back at UVic's Pet Cafe. Here's Tess Van Stratton with Vital People. That's bear. These four-legged fur balls. This is Nelly. Hi, Nelly Bobelli. Are getting ready to spread some puppy love. She's a lab Bernese cross. Yeah, that's where she gets her. Uh, that's where she gets her calm. And the cute canines are helping to calm stressed-out students at the University of Victoria. Good girl. We've got all shapes and sizes. They're all very friendly and sweet. I think the students get a lot out of it. They're all away from home. It's a very stressful time. Come on in. Have a seat. Pacific Animal Therapy Society volunteers have been coming to this pet cafe, a partnership with UVic's Multi Faith Center, the Anglican Diocese of BC, and St. John's Ambulance for the last five years. It's been fabulous to be up here at UVic and um, meet all these lovely young people who are away from home and studying and on the precipice of all kinds of greatness. This is so awesome. Yeah, it's every Wednesday. It's amazing. I love it's that. It's the only thing keeping me going. For students, the Wednesday afternoon on-campus cuddle session at Finnerty Gardens <laughs> and the Multi-Faith Center are an important mental health boost. This is my first time. This is so good. It's just therapeutic. It feels really healing and just special. I think like sensory, just of like touching their fur and like having the company of a pet is really nice, especially since we're in dorms. It's nice to have a break from all the stress. It's just a really stressful time, so it's nice that we can come over here and just de-stress with all the dogs. The Pacific Animal Therapy Society, PATS for short, has been making a difference for more than three decades. It was founded 30 three years ago by Sadie Guy, a retired nurse. There is a Paws and Tails literacy program where we do reading with children in elementary schools. We do um, individual visits in hospitals, at the cancer clinic, in care homes, in private residences. Hello ladies, Hi. how are you? Completely volunteer run, PATS is all about building connection and community. I know. And the volunteers who give their time say they get so much more back. It just seems to bring a lot of peace and happiness. I am always surprised. I come here and I think I'm going to give back to the community, but really I get so much out of it. As these pooches spread joy with each pat and snuggle. Vital People, brought to you by the Victoria Foundation. Connecting people who care with causes that matter.